Hey guys, so we're going to be taking a look here at what could possibly be the best team in the game right now. I think there is a very, very strong argument to be made that this is the best team in the game right there alongside just the pure version of hybrids and GT. I think those three uh, teams are, are up there for the best. Future is kind of up there, but I think Future got heavily, heavily uh, negatively impacted by the release of this Gojuta Blue because of his ability to nullify the endurance, which a lot of those characters have. But obviously you guys can see why this team is so good. We have uh, pretty much, this is just sagas from the movies, right? Uh, Gogeta Blue, Beast, Gohan, and Pan. So essentially what we've done is we've just replaced the pure hybrid team with Gogeta Blue over future Gohan. Now the difference between this team and the pure hybrid team is I think the pure hybrid team is going to allow you to put out way more damage. And that's obviously just due to the equipment options that the team has on the hybrid uh, build. Uh, which we are not going to be able to use because obviously Gogeta is not a hybrid Saiyan. However, Gogeta himself is so stupid that that's not as important as just using Gogeta, right? So um, for the equipment options, I think it's pretty self-explanatory. I actually went with a bit of a more defensive option for Gogeta here. This whole team is a bit more of a defensive team. Uh, this is just, it speaks for itself. I talk about this every single video. This one is really good. Um, obviously, Gogeta can benefit from everything on this equipment, both defenses, special move, ultimate HP restoration. Now, this last one, uh, this will be replaced once the uh, the Awaken equipment comes out soon. So I'm actually going to show you guys what Awaken equipment I'm talking about. There is one that's coming out. I think it's either going to be this coming like weekend or uh, next week for reset. Where is it? This, this one right here. Let's take a look at this. So... This one, uh, I don't think the memories for this are actually ob obtainable yet. I could actually, I, I think this is not available yet, but this is still really good. Like 13% both defenses, 13% special move, and 35% strike strike attack. Really strong for Gogeta. That will replace uh, the one on the right there for him. And I think that's what the setup is that I would go with. Beast Gohan, I went for a bit of a more defensive uh, route for him. This is just giving a lot of HP. Uh, special move ultimate strike defense. This one... HP, HP restoration, both defenses. And then this one is the offensive version that we're gonna go with here. Pan, I also went with a bit more of a defensive build for her. This is double defense. Uh, oops, let me click it. Double defense HP. We got this, which is also double defense HP. And then this is a mix of offense and defense here. Now the bench, I went with the Dragon Ball Super Broly for the Zenkai buff for Gogeta. I went with the Super Saiyan 3 Goku because this guy gives both offenses to movies. And he's also giving the extra strike attack buff to Sun Family, which obviously is going to impact Gogeta in the leader slot there. Um, and then the last slot I went with the Great Saiyan 1 and 2 to give the... the, the I, want, I wanted to give Pan a bit of a more... A uh, bit of a more uh, tanky setup here because you could also technically go with like Ultra Broly on this team in the bench because he also does buff the whole team. He gives a nice uh, special move and ultimate damage buff, I think. No, actually, no, I think it's, it's I think it's just ultimate to uh, movies as well, which is nice. And you could use something like the Bojack movie green trunks over the Goku instead. I'm actually not sure if that Trunks' additional strike attack is better than this Goku's 3% strike arts damage buff. I'm not sure on the math on that, but... This is typically the, the setup that I use for the um, the hybrid team. So we will go with this. I this this is a I mean this is like literally in contention for best team in the game, if not straight up the best team in the game. So I don't expect to have any issues here. This should be a pretty dominant uh, <laughs> pretty dominant showing by this team. Okay, Gogeta on GT. It looks like that's what we got here. Um, he's off with Gogeta. Cool. I mean, does he just save here? He does, yeah. Probably smart. Let's tap here, go into pan, press the main. I'm not gonna go for anything here. Okay, well that sucks. Uh, he sized up last time, I'm assuming he's gonna do the same thing this time. Yep, this guy just does the same thing every time. Damn, I didn't let go back in already. Sucks. Uh, I'll go with Gohan here. Okay, well now we can't because he nullifies cover. We'll get our gauge built. Alright, blast. That's fine, we'll take that. Still, he's still nullifying it, okay. 
He didn't jump at all. Okay, he goes right away. Okay, this guy's just going crazy, dude. He's just, he's just pressing random cards at this point. Okay. Cool. Alright, he has his gauge here, which sucks. Yep, random cards. I'll press a random card. There you go. Have fun with that. Bardock on GT over the yellow Goku, huh? I'm not sure about that one. Empty jump. Nice delay. Goes right away, okay. Going to Bardock is fine. Dark gauge here. Sure. Does not care about cover now. And we're tied neutral, right? Actually, no, we're not tied neutral yet. We need more counts to elapse first. Interesting. Makes sense because he heals later, so. What the hell? <laughs> he just goes wrong. He does not care at all. Alright, let's go with this. Alright, we're just gonna go right away against this guy now, I guess. Is it green? It's not. Four. Okay. I'll take it. Thanks for endurance. Let's go into Pan when we can here. Oh. Got this. Bardock. This. Press this. Sub count reduction. Alright, we're gonna go into Gogeta. How much does this do? Remember, we are stacking up Pan's support as this fight goes on. Full <laughs> screen. Alright, relax. Alright, this guy's crazy. Well, now that we know that he's crazy, we can try and bait him into doing stuff. Last time he dodged. Okay, last time he didn't dodge. Okay. For his hand. He goes into Goku and presses the green. I go into Gogeta. Okay. Nice damage. Yeah, we can. I think the smarter thing to do is this, actually. This is the smarter thing to do. Uh, I'll go blue. I'll just use a bunch of blue cards. Nice. He probably has his second rush. If not now, it's coming up in like 10 counts. So we gotta be aware of that. 
<clears throat> I, I, I'm gonna pop this just to, for the heal. Full screen. Yeah, he plays around armor cancel. Alright, now we don't care about cover. My goal is just to uh, combo this into Gogeta. Alright, let's do this. Get our key here. Does this kill? Yeah, they're dead. <laughs> okay. See ya. Alright, you're dead. See ya. Mono purple with Ultra Broly and Gogeta. Huh. Certainly interesting. I definitely clicked that. He just, is he just one-shotted? You guys think I'm going to one-shot him here? What do you think? <clears throat> what do you think? He's not one-shotted. Okay. These guys are pretty tanky on uh, mono purple. Oh, okay, I guess we just can't move. Let's do this. All right. Don't care about cover now. This is fine. We can pop pan. Do we, pop Do we even pop her main here? I feel like we just save it. We don't even need to reduce subcount at all here. Okay. Sure. Are we dead? Yeah, I think we're dead. Damn. This hand is awful. Okay, thanks for the gauge. I feel like did we just kill anybody with this? Let's let's just go for it. Is Broly dead? No way. Did <laughs> that'd be insane if this killed him. Oh my god. Are you actually kidding me? No way. This is a mono purple team. You know how many buffs he has? Okay. Now we kill this guy. He's dead, right? You don't have to ult. Yeah. Destroys Dragon Balls. Okay, get that left. All right, Gogeta on GT. This is green. Interesting. Damn, I thought it would jump twice. Okay, we built up our gauge. <laughs> you can't do. Yeah, I mean it's just ridiculous. Okay. Five more counts, we get our first buff. I sh I'm gonna do this. Okay, Super Saiyan 4s. Okay, 17. I'm gonna go back into Pan here. TV? No. I really want a blast card. Really, give me a blast, please. I should eat these tap attacks. What? What? I wanted to go into Gohan. What? <laughs> what? I wanted to go into Gohan. All right, whatever. 
Hit him with this. Interesting. Is he dead? Alright, nice switch. Cool. And that's probably game over. <laughs> yeah, stupid. Okay, this is interesting. Tapion and uh, Gogeta with Gohan here. Interesting, but doing strike. Pretty good. Alright, let's go into Beast because we've covered all with him, obviously. Okay. I think what I want to just do here is... Grab a rush using Beast Gohan's cover null and then just <laughs> just rush with Gogeta, right? Tapian definitely is annoying though. This guy's 4 million HP, by the way. Tapian is definitely annoying because he can just switch in on the rush, right? That's the... It goes right away with that, okay. Um, this is gonna hurt. Ow. Be cool. I was thinking about dropping there. And full range strike, pretty good. Let's do this. Grab the Dragon Ball. It's going to you. Is he dead? Is this one? Probably not. We don't have a full gauge here. Damn. If this was the hybrid team, he would have been dead there. Just saying. Alright, you're dead. Interesting. I can't blast here. Alright, well now we can. Oh, perfect. That's perfect. Why is APM? We destroyed two of his Dragon Balls, too, so we can't rush. Alright, this shouldn't be that bad. Another play I could have done was to rush with Pan, just so that we take less damage from this, but this is not really that bad. Like, look at that. Please go on tank that really well. Interesting. I damn it. I didn't think he would rush there. <laughs> okay, final match here. Looks like, uh, I don't even know what this is. Tapion on Tapion on, I don't know. <laughs> what is we have Tapion as a movie character. We have, I guess, I, I guess this is super reviewed on movies. I guess, like uh, sure, Let's go with that. Super reviewed on movies. Sure, that's fine. Let's have you combo for a little bit here. I'm actually gonna do this now. Let's go with the cell count reduction. No, he killed the green. God damn, I was saving that for beast. Side stop. Are you kidding me? How does that always happen? Wait, why'd he eat that? Whenever I size stuff like that, I always draw the blue. It's insane how often that happens. Watch it, it's gonna happen again. <laughs> okay. Yeah, there's the heal. That was coming. I knew that was coming. 987, should be good enough? Oh, <laughs> just barely. Alright, we get our gauge here. Hello? Need a green. I can't rush, because if I do, I'll just go into Tapion. This kind of sucks. 
Damn it. Okay, that's fine. Tapion's pretty good in this meta against Gogeta, because of that. Okay. Drop. This, does this kill? Please. Thank you. Alright, don't have to worry about him now anymore. Uh, I can destroy two of his Dragon Balls with the main ability. I'm so tempted just to press it because of that. Okay. Nothing. Alright, Gojita's just fully built up, which means we should win. He knows I have a blue. I'm gonna go with the blast. Alright, get out of here. I think now we just press the main. Nothing. No! Dude, come on. <laughs> okay, I thought I pressed it right when he jumped. All right, well, there you go. <laughs> is, this the, is this the second time we've had this exact forfeit screen in this video? <laughs> I mean, this guy pretty much had no chance anyway, even if that rush wasn't, wasn't gassed, because we still have Beast Gohan's main ability and stuff, so. Yeah, this team's pretty insane. Um, again, I think, at the very least, this team is top three. Uh, I would probably argue it as the best. Just It just has too many, like, the offensive power on this team the tools that Beast Gohan has, the tools that Gogeta has in terms of disruption with the unique is like there's too much going on for this team to not be the best, in my opinion. GT has a lot of really good stuff too, so I think if I had to choose between two teams that were in the top run, in the running for the top two best teams, it'd probably be this or uh, or GT. Pure Hybrid is really good too, Future's really good. So honestly, the meta right now is looking pretty solid in terms of diversity, so uh, I do think they're doing pretty good in terms of balancing that. So let me know down below what you guys thought of this video. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you all in the next one.